director Clemens Hartenbach explained that Arsenal made an approach for the young defender, but right now all the signs are that the player will remain in Germany. Arsenal have made Matus an offer, he said. We assume Soinku will play for us next season. Meanwhile, Freiburg manager Christian Streich took an even harder stance on the issue. He insisted the club will not even entertain the prospect of negotiations to sign the centre-back in the current window. We plan to keep him, Strike stated. We will not sit at the negotiation table this summer. Turkish football's understanding of the situation is that Freiburg placed a 30 million euros, 26.7 million pounds, valuation on the defender to keep the likes of Arsenal at bay for the time being. So Inky's contract doesn't expire until 2021, so the club can take their time and evaluate their options at this stage. Soinku didn't feature in Freiburg's recent 3-0 preseason win over Swansea City, as he is currently out with a muscle injury. The player's agent has made it clear to the club that his client wants to leave this summer, but for now that doesn't look likely to happen. In Arsenal's case, Soinku only has until next Thursday to complete a move. After that, the English window closes, and he'll have to wait until January.